hello students today i will discuss about the entropy as you are aware that entropy measures the disorder or randomness of any system so it measures it measures the randomness or disorder of any system right so now you need to understand what is the meaning of disorder or randomness so to understand this let's take we have a one substance or one system and from that substance we want to obtain the maximum work and that work uh, can be expansion work or uh, compression work right so to uh, to get to, to get the maximum work from any system what we require we require the motion of particles or motion of atoms in the system or in the substance the the, the motion of particles it must be in one precise direction right so or or we can say that the arrangement of the particles of any system that system from where we get we want to uh, obtain the maximum work we want to obtain the work it should be the particles of that system and or that substance should be arranged in one particular direction and that is called order right um, if let's take if 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 there is a, a case where there is a randomness or disorder in your system so if there is a randomness or disorder of uh, disorder in the system then the energy of that system is more disturbed or more dispersed right <clears throat> and one more thing you, you need to understand that every system if every system tries to go to the higher disorder right so to understand this let's say we ha we, we have a one uh, solid substance right this is your solid and we know that in the solid every particle or every atom they have their specific place that they, they have the fixed position right so they are in more ordered form and it tries to reach tries to go to the higher disorder so it tries to go into the goes into go, uh, into the liquid phase where the molecules or particles are in disorder right there, there is a more randomness and this is try to go where into the gas right so every spontaneous system they always try to move towards a higher disorder right so every spontaneous system move towards to higher disorder okay. now what uh, now th this is about the randomness or disorder now what information we get from the entropy so entropy tell us the amount of energy amount of energy means here it is a thermal energy the amount of thermal energy the amount of ther thermal energy uh, thermal energy which is unavailable for useful work right so entropy it tell us it tell us that the amount of thermal amount of thermal energy which is unavailable for which is unavailable for useful work so entropy measures the unavailability of or degradation of energy unavailability of energy or degradation of energy if the unavailability of energy of any system increase the entropy of that system will also increase so unavailability of any system if the availability of any system increase then the entropy of that system will also increase so that is what about the entropy hope you understand the concept of entropy thank you